Welcome to Wearviews. Before we start with the video, please provide your feedback in the comments below, and if you like to see more of these videos, please subscribe. Website Views It's Christmas time at Tommy John's website. We are here to find the Tommy John second skin boxer briefs with the hammock pouch. You can see Tommy John does offer a bunch of styles for different preferences. We filtered into the second skin and found the mid-length boxer briefs. It doesn't look like they offer the same color we are reviewing, but it should not be that different. This is the second skin hammock pouch mid-length boxer brief costing 38 US dollars which is considered at the top of the premium market. Tommy John does show how the hammock pouch works in the graphic with two balls inside the pouch. They currently offer these in five colors, and these will change as new designer colors are added and dropped. They are offered in five sizes from small to two times extra large. 28 inches to 46 inches in width. Looking at product details and features, these 6 inch insium that provides enough coverage and doesn't show under shorts. The inner pouch design supports your assets to prevent bat wing, no sticking, no swinging and no chafing. The hammock pouch has a lightweight air mesh fabric, so it allow your assets to breathe. The fabric is made with silky soft micro-modal fabric, so that it will not create any lint balls or fuzz. The waistband won't roll, bunch or pinch, as this is expected at this price point. Back to the pouch, it's contoured so that your boys will sit nicely in the pouch. The fly is horizontal, and it allows quick access without having to dig in to pull it out when nature calls. Lastly, the fabric is made with 90% micro-modal and 10% spandex. How it works We will pick up the bright blue boxer briefs to have a closer look. The Tommy John logo is right in the middle of the waistband with a hammock image right beside it. The waistband is soft, and the quality is good at this price point. The back is stitched together at the back and is flat, but is not covered to hide it up. Looking closer to the pouch area, you can see the stitching that creates the contour pouch with the horizontal fly opening at the top. On the bottom of the left leg, the hammock pouch words are printed to denote the difference between the non-hammock pouch. The back of the interior, information about these boxer briefs are printed on the back. We put down the boxer briefs to look at the front at a hole. We point out the outline of the pouch area and the stitching of the insium. As we lift up the boxer briefs, you can see the pouch intersects the insium gusset which creates a very comfortable fit for most men. We flip over the underwear to see the back side. There is no stitch on the back other than the insium gusset and the sides. We flip over the underwear to see what inner side. First thing draws to our attention is the mesh hammock pouch. They do seem a bit small when you compare them to Saks's ballpark pouch. The design is a combination between the two under or benches pouch with the material of the Saks's pouch. The mesh is thin and allows air to flow through allowing the boys to keep cool and creates a barrier to keep the boys in place. 
The mesh is stitched together at the bottom and is flat in the inner side and has a tiny bulge on the outer side. This shouldn't cause any issues with the sack. One disappointing point is the interior stitches are not flat. You would expect them to be flat at this price point. Normal wear should be fine with this type of stitching, but if your boys get outside of the pouch you could rub against the stitch and cause unwanted moments. We try to put the stress ball in the pouch and try to see if it can keep the ball in the pouch. Because of the thin barrier, the ball did not fall into the pouch, but fall out of the underwear. This is may not be a valid experiment, but gives you a sense of the hammock pouch. How it fits. Our model enters the camera view with the boys pointing down. The boxer briefs fits to the skin and stays put as our model does a 360. Our model mimics walking motions to see how they support the assets. A little bouncing, but no showstoppers. Here is a closer look. He adjusts and points up for those guys who enjoys keeping their guy up. The flap of the horizontal fly keeps it away from exposing it through the fly. The pouch keeps the boys pointing up with and does not lean forward much. However, if you point up, you will not be able to use the hammock pouch much as the twig will be outside of the pouch. Our model does some squats to show you how the underwear performs in these motions. There are times when you point up and unexpected moments occur and this is what it looks like with our model. You can see when it gets hard, the hammock pouch is not useful at all. Your comments is critical to help us improve our videos and is welcome. Visit our site for many honest reviews of men's underwear with nothing to hide. Follow and like us on Facebook or Instagram to get up-to-date reviews from our team. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to get up-to-date videos that complement our reviews. See you again next time.